Let's, let's lose the sarongs. Let's lose these. How do we lift these? Yeah, yeah just go for it. This bloke was just like, ah, oh, mate, just grab it, put it on your shoulder, run for a bit, pop it down, go home. Straight up, grabs it. That is fast. Not in so many words. In fact, if anything, in fewer words. He made Marcel Marceau look like something of a chatterbox. Oh, look, his finger's his bleeding. bleeding. His hand's bleeding. Is your hand OK? What an incredibly tender moment. It's OK? I really feel like we connected. I don't think he did, Joe. Mm. Just one of the occupational hazards of carrying fruit. I feel bad because I don't even know the name of our teacher. It's just called the fruit guy. It's just the fast fruit dude. The fast fruity man, that's what I'm going to call him. Ah, he made it look so easy. Shit. Ah, I'm trying to look cool in front of the guy. Okay. All right, you got it, Joel. Now run one kilometre. <laughs> this, this is horrible. Ah. Ah. So uncomfortable, isn't it? Joel did manage to pick it up at the end, but only after doing this. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have a go. Nish, I'm just, I'm, I'm warning you now, I don't, I just don't think you're gonna. Ah! God damn it! Ah! It's heavy. Oh. I hit my nipple. Oh, God. There is nothing nice about that. I feel like right now what's happening is an exact scene of your household when you were a kid. What do you mean? Just you, like, falling on the floor and being like, parents, give me attention, and then they're just carrying on with their daily chores. You're going to really regret that. All of the sand is going to stick to your sweat. All of the sand is going to stick to your sweat? Oh, God, that was so heavy. Oh, Nish, it's all over your face.